Being in Kamloops was, I thought, a fantastic experience. One of the biggest strengths there is the staff there. The docs were incredible at welcoming us into the hospital. I'm the only student who's on my rotation right now. That means whatever comes in the door, it's mine. I get first crack at any clinical experience that we have, and that's a really unique experience. There's better patient continuity, so you can kind of follow a case from start to finish. It's better seeing the whole case rather than a piece of the case. Royal Inland Hospital is a very pleasant place to work, and so of course that fosters learning. It's what we often call the sweet spot. It's got some features of a traditional clerkship with exposure to all the specialties, but it is a smaller site, so there are not nearly as many learners to compete with. The primary focus of the students when they come for their third year clerkship is to gain clinical exposure, to see patients, see as much pathology as they can, and do histories and physicals, and get the clinical aspect of medicine. But it's also about meeting and interacting with preceptors and mentors. Being a part of a small learning group is really beneficial in terms of getting one-on-one -on -one time with preceptors. I don't feel like I'm having to vie for attention. I don't feel like I'm having to wait in line to see something cool or be a part of a procedure. You know, oftentimes it's just me and the preceptor there. And so it's a lot of one-on-one -on -one learning. Being in the smaller center with less learners, you're kind of in that one-to-one -one ratio with the staff. You started to learn how to you know, seek out learning opportunities and really take ownership on your learning. I've gotten to know my preceptors so well. They've seen me day in and day out. They know how I perform. They know my strengths. They know my weakness. And I think when it comes to that really big day when we decide what kind of physicians we want to be, that they're going to get me to where I want to be and give me the reference letter that's really going to set me apart from other applicants. If you're fortunate enough to be one of the six students who comes to Kamloops, you are of course in a small group. So every rotation that you're on, you are the only student. A lot of other sites, you, know, you may be third or fourth in the pecking order. It's been a really incredible experience of like how close that six becomes. We all support each other. We're all on different rotations at different times. And so if I'm coming off of internal medicine and Randy or someone else is coming on to it, I can give her the heads up on what to expect and what different preceptors are like. Kamloops is beautiful. It's the perfect size. People are very friendly. You can live very close to the hospital, which is nice. You don't have to necessarily stay at the hospital while you're on call. I often pop home, have dinner, I'm studying, and I'm only a five minute walk just to jet up to the hospital. Kamloops is a great town. I really enjoyed living there. The weather is beautiful there all the time. The ski hill is a short drive away, so I got up to Sun Peaks quite a bit. I don't get a lot of spare time in general, but my husband and I like to go check out different restaurants or go for a walk downtown, go see the river. I haven't found a shortage of things to do in Kamloops yet. I was so well supported here in Kamloops. I have a great faculty, a great support staff, and I've really made some excellent friends outside of medicine who've made that transition absolutely amazing.